rushing because I just remembered that I had a hair appointment today because I'm getting my hair finally done. I am 10 minutes late already and it's a 10 minute drive so I'm gonna try to drive there as fast as I can but it is really slippery and very snowy out so probably not gonna rush. I did let her know that I'm running a little bit late. I just completely forgot that I had to go there today and that's so terrible but I am gonna go get my hair done real quick. Probably not real quick, probably gonna be a few hours. And when I get out, I will give you guys my little, actually not so little uh, thrift haul. I've been picking up a ton of things these past couple of weeks. And I haven't done a thrift haul in super long, so it's definitely time for one. And I do have a sweater I'm gonna throw on because I don't wanna wear what I'm wearing now because I'm gonna get it all messed up, probably, before. Before I go in though, I want to give you guys a quick before. So, it's looking a little, you know, a little rough. I mean, it, it could be worse, but it is getting pretty dark. Like when I put my hair up, it's just fully dark right here. So, that's what we're doing. Where am I going? How do I look? Uh, yeah, anyway, I got my hair done just for this thrift haul. I have a pile of clothes right here that I have to show you guys that I've been thrifting. It's actually not all, it's actually not all from today, but um, I did thrift like five days ago. I washed it. So some of this is washed and some of this isn't. Let's just honestly just grab whatever's first. So I'm gonna start with this. Let's start with this one because so freaking cute. Okay, so I found this uh, five days ago when I went last time. Not today, but the day before that. Not today. Oh, time before this time today. That I got the cutest vest in the whole entire world. And it's really big. I feel like if you know how to put it together and you make it look cute, it can definitely work. And I love oversized anyways. And look at the cute little flowers. I am obsessed with these flowers. As you guys know, if you guys um, follow my ceramics page by Jenny Lou, I'll put it right here so you guys can go follow it, go look at it, whatever. I have a lot of these like daisies going on. So this is so beautiful. The colors are just stunning. Oh, I love it. The buttons. Look at these buttons. They're so unique. And look at the inside. Oh, so yummy. Yeah, this is definitely a little bit big, but I love big. So that's fine. Next thing, I think we have another vest, yeah. And it's just this very simple black vest. And let me show you, can you guys see? Really heavy, and it just feels like really nice material. And I love the little, like, the little detailing right here. Like, kind of like crochet, crochet detailing, I guess. Next up, I, I honestly, I keep telling myself that I, like, want to dress kind of nice for this thrift haul but fuck it next up we have oh cutest little sweater i hate that you can't try stuff on at the thrift store but i actually did try this on it's actually eddie bowers woman's petite 100 percent cotton honestly it fits so amazing i love it so much it fits so good like so good just so just beautiful. Oh, this is so beautiful. It's perfect for the little color scheme I have going on for by Jenny Lou. Like lime, matcha, avocado green, and pink going on right now with my color scheme. It's like perfection. It kind of just looks like a watermelon and it's just so beautiful, so soft, so heavy, and 
I'm completely obsessed and right now I'm really really loving like this material and just the look of it all. It's like a little undershirt. There's a lot of possibilities. So this is another little little gem. Love you so much. We have just this plain again with the same material that I've been loving like this like what can you call it? Like does it say what this material is? Like a knitted, knitted, there we go, knitted. So I really love this knitted material. It's just, I don't know, like classy, like just clean. I don't know, I really love it. Oh my gosh, oh, again, with the little like knitted situation. This shirt, I actually like, I am so obsessed with this shirt. It's just so soft, the color is stunning. It's like a baby blue, I don't know if the camera is like catching it, but it's, it's so beautiful as you guys have seen the little try on part it was like a pair of like i can just picture this with like a pair of light vintage denim jeans <sighs> love this yeah i really love that this sweater okay it's gorgeous as you guys can see it has like purple little flowers it's it's very beautiful it's very detailed yeah again it looks very like handmade and everything I love it and it looks really nice, but, but, but. I wish that I would have tried it on at the thrift store. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't, just cause like, depends if I'm wearing like an undershirt or something. I didn't get to try it on. And I don't know if it's just me. Let me know if you guys can relate to this, but it drives me crazy, crazy, crazy when things feel like even just like the slightest bit itchy, like I am, I am like not allergic, so sensitive to things that are itchy. I don't know if you guys can like relate. I'm really good at like feeling things out if like they're itchy or not, but this one just like was so beautiful and I'm like, fuck it, I'm sorry. It is a little bit itchy, so I'm, maybe I'll have to wear like an undershirt or two or three, a turtleneck, I don't know. I couldn't pass up on it. Next up, we have this. Just a simple Nike workout top. I love simple things like this because I honestly wear sports bras every single day. So I need as many as I can possibly have, you know? What else? Oh, okay. So this shirt is so stunning. I, again, the color. This color has been super trendy lately. And honestly, it just, it's kind of like, like a silk. Is it silk? It's not silk, but um, it looks like it's silk and it's just, it's super soft, super like, like slippery. It's, it's very comfortable. So I really, really love this shirt. I love the sleeves. It's just, it's very, 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 very beautiful. Next up for more brown, I also got this, just a little cute little sweater. It's just a very simple, really soft sweater i think it's cashmere yeah layer with something else underneath i think because i felt it i got it when i was going through the racks i actually like felt like the sleeve and i was like oh my gosh let me see what the sweater is because it just it felt so soft and i don't know i just i really like it so super simple but let me do this next okay next up i um also got this stage light vintage little knitted is it is it handmade i'm pretty sure it is it feels very handmade it's super heavy gentle cycle no just the pattern really got me and again with these the possibilities are endless i feel like i'll definitely wear this super heavy colors everything then i also got this i um, wasn't too sure about it it does have little um shoulder pads so just like a super simple it's a quarter zip and um, I, my plan with this is maybe cropping it because it is a little long. I like it. I am not like obsessed. I think I just the colors and like the pattern I was really attracted to. But maybe, you know, putting on the right outfit, you know, maybe reconstructing the whole thing. I'm going to move on to pants because I did find some pants, which is super hard for me to find pants. So I actually found these brown dress pants and i i don't know i just feel like dress pants they're kind of hard not hard to shop for i just i feel like i'm kind of short so 
things are usually too long for me. I actually measure them a little bit. Like I tried them on, on top of my pants at the thrift store and they fit so good on the waist. Super form fitting. Last pair of pants. So before we get onto these pants, as you guys will see, these pants fit absolutely amazing. They're just perfection. And I've been looking for leather pants that actually like fit me for the longest time ever. And I came across these. I didn't try them on at the thrift store. I got home and I was like, they could either be so good or so bad. I absolutely am obsessed with them. But then my very smart and beautiful and loving and gentle and creative and um, unique self decides to just throw them in the wash. I threw them in the wash. I didn't throw them in the dryer, so I did wash them and they came out super wrinkled. I called a few dry cleaners and I don't know why, but they say that they don't work with this kind of stuff. So I don't know what's up with that. But yeah, I got these. The best, like literally the best purchase ever. I I wish I was thinking a little bit more when I when I did my laundry. Next, I did find a little handbag and it's this cute little brown like croc print um, bag and it's chocolate colored. It has like a little bit of pink on the inside, which is so cute, so adorable. It has a little bow right here. Paid $6.99 plus I got a discount on it. So I paid like four bucks. Yeah, like four dollars on it. That's yeah, super cute. Let's see, you guys already know like the first thing I do is go straight to the plates, the mugs, the jars, the home decor, everything because they just have the most like, they just have like the most like unique like things and I just go crazy for mugs as you guys may or may not know. That's why I kind of started doing pottery because I just, my obsession is so deep. I got these two mugs and oh my gosh, I am obsessed. So first one, we have this cute little mug. Look how beautiful this detailing is. Oh my goodness, it's so cute, little flowers. And look how tiny it is. It's not tiny, tiny, but like, you know, it's like not the biggest one. I paid like, I paid a dollar. This was at Goodwill actually. Okay, so, um, and then I have this mug right here, which is also so cute, and it's just very vintage-y. Oh, okay, so I just found this. It was right behind me. I also got this Nike little sports bra tank thing. I'm always looking for sports bras because... It just feels good, you know, to work out, feel good in what you work out. And definitely, it's very motivating. So, highly recommend getting yourself some cute sports bras. Just, just things that make you feel good, you know, like confident and just beautiful, sexy. I also got this little plate. Oh my gosh, this plate is so cute. Let me get a little bit closer. This plate is so adorable. I love the detailing, the flowers, the color. Just everything is so beautiful and yeah, it's just perfection. Probably gonna start making some of my own very soon because I just feel like it's just perfect like for salad, for soup, for um, what's it called? Those bowls that I like to make, those um, harvest bowls, quinoa bowls, Buddha bowls. No, what I, you know what I'm talking about, right? It makes food taste better. I don't know if anyone agrees, but I feel like it definitely makes food taste better. I. My mom has forbidden me to bring any more mugs and plates into this house. So what I do now is I don't even tell her. I just put them in my room. I wash them. Whenever I'm ready to use them, I just go to my room and I grab them because they honestly just don't fit in my kitchen anymore. Like I, it's, um, yeah, it's kind of becoming a problem. Um, I kind of find a, a way to store these. I, this, this is totally random, but I also got this little, um, what do you call this? Um, what do you call this? What do you call this? What do you call this? I don't know, maybe I could use it for my YouTube. Like, oh, maybe I'll use that. How much is this? This is $1.99. Not too bad. Oh. oh my gosh, I almost forgot to show you the cutest, like, 
the cutest thing I found. Look at this freaking basket. It's pink. I'm pretty sure it was like a baby's, like a baby girl's um, basket. It has the cutest little pattern on it. And it's all pink all around. This is perfect for my ceramics. It's just like a perfect way to store it, to like bring it to the studio or bring it home from the studio. And it's just, it's just so cute. The color, the pink, everything. It, it drives me crazy. It was only $4.99. Yeah, so I think that's all we have for today. Yeah, that's all we have. I feel like I had more. Okay, well. I really needed that stretch. Getting your hair done is like very exhausting. Like your body just gets so tight from sitting. I am going to leave the video here, I think, because I am going to go eat something. It's basically dinner time. I've only had a coffee and I'm just tired from sitting and Thrifting. Thrifting is very exhausting. Like, I love it so much. Like, if I could go every single day, I would. But it is very exhausting. And I just, I need some food in my stomach. So, I'm going to go do that. I love doing thrift hauls. I've been thrifting so much. And thrifting is just the best way to shop, honestly. Like, not for everything, of course. Like, underwear and socks. Well, actually, socks are pretty cute. Oh, socks. Okay, so I okay, so I got these socks, and um, I don't know if these are genuine like polo socks, but they look pretty legit. Honestly, I don't even care if they are because they're so beautiful. Look at these colors, like these colors are so freaking beautiful. I love them. Um, but yeah, I got these socks, so cute, and they were brand new in the pack and. Okay, now I think I'm definitely done. But yeah, I um, yeah, I'm gonna leave the video here. I hope you guys enjoyed this thrift haul. I love making thrift hauls. Honestly, guys, go thrifting. Stop buying so much online. Like I said, obviously there's things you can't buy at the thrift store, but thrifting is just such an amazing way to um, one save money, two save the planet. Obviously, thrifting is just such a blessing and i love it so much so you can and, and it's such a great way to find really unique pieces and things that you won't see everybody in which is super cool i highly recommend thrifting the majority of your stuff bags belts accessories everything even cookware dinnerware shoes everything it does take a little bit of patience because you're not always going to find what you're looking for, but you just have to go in there with an open mind, try things on if possible, just, you know, see the bigger picture. I hope you guys love this video. I hope you guys loved my hair and I will see you guys in my next video. Have a beautiful, blessed day. Don't forget to be super grateful today. Try to make someone else happy. Tell yourself beautiful things. Tell others beautiful things. Don't forget to smile at somebody. Try to make somebody else happy today. But yeah, I love you guys so much. It's February 8th or 9th. I hope you guys are having an amazing year so far. And honestly, if you feel like you're not, you actually really are because everything that you go through, good or bad, is teaching you and it's helping you grow so much and you don't even know it, but it's helping you grow so, so much. So just stay positive and just know that everything that you go through, good, good and bad because I feel like there's no really good and bad because everything is honestly just good because it's helping you in a way. It's helping you grow, expand, and just become better. But I don't think there's really a bad, to be honest. Even though like when you're in the moment, it does feel like it's horrible and you feel sad and depressed and anxious, but it's actually just making you grow. Anyway, I love you so much. God bless you. And I'll see you in my next video. And bye.